Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to Technology Explore. My name is Usman and today in this video I am going to show you how you can add the isometric dimensions or you can also say 3D dimensions in SolidWorks drawings. So keep watching this video till end. Okay let's get started. Uh, to add 3D or isometric dimensions is very easy in SolidWorks. You just have to import 3D or isometric view of your desired part and uh, then click on annotations and from here simply select smart dimensions and uh, then start adding the dimensions for example i am going to add the total length of this part simply this line and this is the total length of the part then uh, let's say i am going to add the dimension for this uh, width so select this line if you are not okay with the direction with this direction of the dimension then press escape key then select this line and this line and the di direction of the dimension will be changed so uh, similarly adding the dimension from here up to here simply this if you are not okay with this direction of this dimension then press escape once again select this line and this point the direction uh, of the dimension will be changed so um, adding the dimension for this hole so simply select this circle or this circle this time let me select this circle and simply click here now uh, what should you do go to leaders here and uh, these are the type of uh, dimensions select linear and then drag the mouse like this okay uh, how to change the direction of this uh, dimension simply you if you can see here it, it's a dot click on this dot and rotate the dimension so now scroll down and here are some other options for the text position so you can uh, check your desired text position if you can see these arrows are outside this line if you want them inside then uh, if you can see here these dots so uh, click on these dots like this once again rotate the dimension here and uh, next thing is that um, adding the dimensions for uh, fillets here is the fillet again select the smart dimension from here and click on this fillet now dimension has been added okay click here then click on this dot to reverse the direction of the arrow like this and then you can also uh, drag these arrows to extend the uh, extension line next thing is that how to add this diameter so for that click here and here so automatically if you can see the diameter sign has been added okay next thing is that uh, click on this dimension and then go to leaders scroll down from here check this box custom text position and this again scroll down again and from here select this option okay next thing uh, next dimension is adding this width it is very simple simply click on this line so uh, if you can see here this width if you are not okay with this direction you can also choose another option by clicking this line and this line so this dimension has been added i hope you have enjoyed and learned from this video thanks for watching and spending time and don't forget to subscribe this youtube channel for more videos like this